week, everyone predicted a runoff would happen, even the candidates. So now begins the next part of the campaign. Three more years. Even before the numbers dropped, we knew. Everyone knew. Looks like it's going to be a runoff. We anticipated that. And we're very well prepared for a runoff. Yeah, well, it's clear from the results that voters want to change. And that part isn't, I mean, that part's not surprising. But, um, you know, in terms of the margin, that's, you know, really, really encouraging. Get ready to hear more from Dave Bronson and Suzanne LaFrance. A lot more. Let's do this. Woo! The most recent campaign report shows Bronson has three times the amount of money to spend over LaFrance. With cash on hand, minus debt, Bronson has $157,600 to LaFrance's $54,300. The biggest issues, the homeless crisis and plowing, and which person can best handle them as the mayor of Anchorage? And so we've got to get the basics right, we know that, so that we can tackle some of these big issues. And it starts with a competent team. Um, Suzanne likes to pick on me for snow removal, and she says, uh, you know, ultimately the mayor is responsible for everything that's under his or her watch, and I am. But as a matter of control, if she thinks as mayor she's going to come in and start creating snow plowing plans on her own, that's called micromanagement. I expect numbers to change several times over the next couple of weeks. And on our website, we have a new podcast about the race for mayor and a look at how the props are performing. The pipeline is new and live. It is on our website right now.